Hi guys and welcome to another review of Scoundrel. So you guys all remember to see one of you were kissing like in the Mlungis saw them, you know, <laughs> like they did <were> kissing. <laughs> and then when they realized that Mlungis were nearly like, uh, well, um, Mlungis just dropped off guys and left them in shock. Like they were just shocked to go to heaven. I wonder if William Long is still crazy though. Anyway, uh, guys, we uh, didn't just surprise EQ with a bottle of something a drink and told EQ that, you know, someone was impressed in a presentation. I mean, I yay, can we drink while we work? Because we have a lot of work to do. Well, she thanked Okuman EQ for helping hang a presentation. I in you saved my, you saved my life, you saved my career. Well, we didn't went and asked EQ to be on her side since Ulela is engaged against her well like you said i don't think uh Leila will appreciate me working with you did beg him not to say anything for now until she is able to do this job on her own you know and then okay uh, great but then okay went on and said that you know what like when um didn't like, you need Leila on your side on your side because she's good and i'm saving so we'll see oh then did he said okay it's fine i'll see what i can do well Says our one now to Ulela also from seven and we didn't learn. Well, Omlungis is disturbed by what he saw at the parking, guys. Like when he got home from work, since I was so good, how was your day? Omlungis told her that something is bugging him and told Osin that he saw someone shitting on someone he knows. Well, it was obvious that he was talking about Grace. Well, Omlungis said at him. Okay, I think it's important. It's important to let the other party know what hey, your umundwako is shitting. Well, Uzin said, no, 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 no. It's not your place. It's not your business. Puma goyo. Hmm, guys, asas. Anyway, uh, moving forward, Ukumani and Leila are here discussing this presentation. Ukuman, at it's impre like they were impressed, guys. They were impressed and asked Leila if she will step in and save the day once Udintle loses focus. Well, Leila agreed, but Ukuman went and said, but if she continues doing a great job like she's doing now, I hope we will give her support, you know, like support that she needs. Hmm. Hmm. Disappointment for Leila. <laughs> Well, of course, went to Linda's flat or your Kuluman CJ. Well, CJ, I'm sorry, but you wasted your time. I have nothing to say to you. Well, Olinda was first. Oh, 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 CJ, you must talk to a host. Clan Kuluman and Long is a lento. But well, CJ turned his back and locked himself in a room. Well, of course, just stood at his door and said his apologies, guys. Well, Kulmin Lego to know what I'm sorry for Yonkin Tek Velele. I am sorry, but CJ he is he is not buying it. Yo, CJ, you need to cut cause some slack, but tung oya zama ya zum tana want to like oya zam. You know, yes, guys. Wouldn't like called Olila in her office and I she would like to apologize apologize for accusing her of setting her up for fail at actually what you are doing, Leila, is challenging me, and your challenges now, except of course they will help me to grow. <laughs> and wouldn't I tell you, Leila, would my siblings is an unhappy number problems, and said she would appreciate if Leila would work hand in hand with her, you know, be on her side. Well, Leila, at yeah, this is the didn't I know thinking for wouldn't let pill. <laughs> And I can see that what you're trying to do when I didn't. You're trying to manipulate me so that I can be on your side. Well, Leila. Oh, 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 Leila, when I didn't, like, do you really expect me to work with you after you have stolen my job? Like, do you really expect me to exhibit in the sun in our way, Well, wouldn't they tell you that, you know what, Leila? Looks like we must do, um, seven in the company, we must be on the side, you know, like, which is true, whether by a zone or a zone, looks like they must do good for the company. Well, anyway, guys, moving forward to the love birds. <laughs> well, Shivan's mom rocked up at Venom's place. Well, Venom told them that he's the one who found her. Lubama, I'm not buying this store that you are getting married to, and I'm trying to ask you, Shivan. I know you're probably looking for attention or something. Well, Venom, I know, mom. I love your daughter, and I'm going to marry her. Hey, as you know, alone, I. Well, Chevron's mom said, oh, my daughter is just using you to get my attention. What kind of attention? Just to cry for help. Well, news flash, there won't be a wedding. Finish. Just like that. Yo, guys, I don't know. <laughs> and then Oromo went to Golilas, no grace to give them a feedback about Ognyamana uh, Loka room. And they have found Romeo's car, but there was no one inside. Like, there was no sign of Romeo. The car was unlocked and the key was still in the ignition, guys. But Grace said, look, since there's nobody, it means there's still hope. And I will find my son. Like, I will do anything to find my son. Okay? Yeah, it's bad, guys. It's very bad. Anyway, that's all I have for you guys. And thank you so much for watching. I love you. See you on the next episode. Bye.